All right, to our weather now, we hope the string can continue into the weekend. We hope so. Let's check in with Lonnie Quinn, see how it's shaping up. I, I think Saturday's going to be a great day. Full steam ahead on any outdoor activities. Sunday, it, it, look, Sunday still looks pretty good. There are a few little speed bumps along the way on Sunday. We'll talk about everything. Right now, my picture is showing you a mostly clear sky overhead as you look out over New York City. 73 degrees, the official reading right now in Manhattan and Central Park. 83 was the high. Two degrees cooler than we typically find for this time of the year. What do you expect as we look ahead. I, I keep raving about your day on Saturday. It's going to be a great start to the weekend. Now, there are changes that we've been talking about all day to Sunday's forecast. Yes, I do see more rain chances on Sunday. That part is true, but I've been saying great timing. It's more like early in the morning before you really get started with your day, and then at the end of the day, as things start winding down, and then for next week, the 90s are coming back, so the heat is on. This is what we see right now, and you see a little dancing green on the screen. Well, it's not making its way down to the surface. We had a couple little showers, even a couple of thunderstorms pushed through today. A lot of folks didn't see anything out there, but for the most part, we're setting up now for just a great looking Saturday. A couple of high pressure systems are in control. Saturday looks nice. By Sunday, we're watching initially a warm front come into the area. This is going to be part of Sunday's rain chances, but the trailing cold front also part of Sunday's rain chances. How does it time out? Saturday, beautiful. By Saturday, say 7, 8 o'clock at night, I think you are going to start seeing more clouds float into the area. And then that warm front, I told you, that's going to get here first. All right, so that will bring the stronger rain. But it's like kind of overnight into the early morning hours, 5, 6, 7 a.m. There's your warm front. Could be some bouts of heavy rain out there. That sort of pushes on through, say, 2, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. You're enjoying your day. Some folks with a partly sunny sky, but there's still a chance for a light little shower at that point. That would not be much of anything. And then that cold front I showed you, that was trailing, will come through and with a rain chance later. Uh, this is 8, 9, 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock at night. The stronger rain would be early in the morning on Sunday, and hey, there is a chance that it could be severe. We're going to watch all of that. How much rain do you pick up? You know, it looks like anywhere from some very small numbers. A lot of folks are less than a half an inch, but it could go anywhere from a tenth of an inch up to an inch, maybe a little bit more if you get some of those training showers or storms in your area. It's a situation and a setup we've been dealing with, you know, for a, a, a number of days. You know, you know how wet July has been, and we've often seen this format where some folks see a lot of rain, other folks see very little, but it is part of this forecast. And I know it's showing New York City with the big number, 1.3. That could set up almost anywhere. North of the city, certainly a possibility. As far as what's going to be happening, with our seven day forecast. <laughs> yeah, that button's not going to work. Let's try this button. Oh, look at my people in the control room. Got my back. I, I love this place, man. I really do. All right, across the board. Saturday's great. Sunday is okay. Daytime hours are okay on Sunday. There's still a little bit of a rain chance during the day, but it's more so early and then late. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, you're hovering right around 90 degrees. I've been saying all along it could be our next heat wave. You would need Monday or Thursday to be a 90 in order to establish the next one. We'll see if we can do it. Let's hope so. Thank okay, you, guys. Lonnie. Yeah.